Okay, you guys, hello, happy Thursday. If you don't know who I am, you're new to my channel. I'm Jennifer Bell. That's my name, and I discuss everything, um, you know, everything that affects me, that has affected me from mental health to my new fitness journey I'm taking, um, traveling, parenting, all different kinds of things. I love discussing, you know, because life is just full of so many variables, and so I like to kind of share them all just because they're all things. They can end up going you know, melding with another one. So I just like to share everything. But this is a product unboxing. And so I wanted to share this with you guys, Um, you know, because I just like to show you what I'm buying and what really helps me in life, what I don't recommend. Um, Just things that give you a east, uh, more uh, um, stressless life um, that I think are worth the money and things that are just good to have, you know, because we all need a better quality of life and having less stress, using less energy. We need our energy for going around with our kids, keeping up with them. We need it for our workouts. We don't need it for like little dumb stuff. So let's see if I can open this. Oh, I was going to say, I know I brought out a knife. You know, and I, you know, I'm trying to learn to downsize now, but certain things are just so, they're so good to have because they really just make your life easier and to have life easier, how much is that worth to you, you know, because we use so much energy every day and so much time and stuff like that. And it just seems like we have no money, no time, no energy left for ourselves. Okay. So this is if, okay, I started my fitness journey back in 2019, the summer of 2019, I started with interval training and then later that year in the winter I started doing yoga. I have started incorporating meditation. I probably started doing that a couple weeks ago and then I also found a new YouTuber that she has a walking channel and so you know for some of us we we love the idea of running. You see other people running and they just look so graceful. They just look like they're having the time of their lives and the rest of us are just like <laughs> enjoy that run for me. And so, um, I want to do walking instead. So like that could be a total cardio because walking is good for you. Actually, to be honest, from what I've heard is that walking is better for you than cardio because it still gives you that heart, um, beating and blood flowing and the cardio and just the the sweat coming off and stuff like that, but it's not so hard on your heart. It's not so hard in your joints, things like that. And especially when you have a bigger chest running, it's just not fun anyways. If you're not almost knocking your yourself out, then they're just heavy and they hurt. So I just want to do walking. Um, and so as I started doing the walking workouts, I realized that this, it's, it's so fun because they actually incorporate, she incorporates other stuff into it. Arm exercises, she incorporates kicks, um, grapevines, all those kinds of things, sidesteps. And so, you know, you can do walking and it can actually be made fun. Most people just think of walking like, ugh, you know, you already got to walk in the store, walking, you know, walk here, walk there, walking is not fun. But when you're incorporating stuff like this, like, look at how cool this is. So this is a seven ring band. And this is from one of the YouTubers I follow. If you have any questions about this, um, comment below and I can let you know who that is. Um, but yeah, this is... This is so cool. So it's kind of like a silicone-y, um, how would I, it's like the, um, I'm trying to think of a good thing to, to compare this to. Um, I can't think of anything right now. It's kind of like jello-y, um, but obviously more durable. Um, so this is a resistance band. So basically like you can walk and like pull it if you want to hold it. Um, if you want to, I'm not exactly sure yet. She's only used it for one, but basically like she had one where she was kind of like have your arms out and then it kind of like gives you some stretch I don't even remember it was like honestly the only one I saw where she was using this but I was like that is so cool and I was kind of expecting it to be a little um a little different but I love this because it's just totally fun to like hold um you know some materials aren't as fun and so it just doesn't make you excited but like this is like totally cool it's like a jelly um so I want to say this is like silicone-ish um I'm pretty sure there's some information about it but this is just really cool so this is resistance band um that you use while you're walking and so if you're ever on there and you just see a lot of workouts that are just really lame it's just like 
all they do is walk include stuff like this because this is like totally fun. I mean, there's a yellow one, there's a gray one, and it just doesn't it just look fun. And like I said, it's a resistance band, um, and there's seven rings on it, and this so that's why it's called Seven Rings. Um, and I just really think this is neat just because it's easy to hold. It's just really fun and squishy. Like if you have anxiety, a lot of times you like to squish things. And so um, it just kind of helps you get rid of some of the anxiety you have because it, at the same time that you're getting your exercise in, you're doing something good that's for your mental health that's just kind of like getting you to focus on squeezing it because it's just so fun, <laughs> you know? Um, and having anxiety, it's just like, especially during meditation, it's so hard because I literally find myself floating to everywhere else and the whole entire five minutes or like 10 minutes oh, my eyes are watering because I just it's just so funny like if you're having a hard time focusing meditation don't feel bad you're not the only one that's why they say they give you um affirmation or a mantra to to repeat to yourself or to focus on your breathing because it literally happens to so many of us it's hard to sit there for five minutes and it's not even just people with anxiety it's just like gosh we have so much going on in life and you're thinking about what is your kid doing right now like I should be doing this like what do I have on my to-do list what have I already got done and it's crazy right so my eyes are watering yeah <laughs> this is probably why I take immune stuff because it's been helping with my allergies I um usually have allergy problems all day every day my eyes would always be watering I'd always be sneezing and honestly I have not taken any allergy stuff in like two years I had a prescription but I wasn't um, I just found myself finding it harder to, to not use it and having some immune stuff, just some quality immune stuff just really helped. So it feels good to like, finally my eyes are like doing something because I just gotten so used to feeling so good and not having any allergy problems that I kind of like forget that I do have allergies. <laughs> I, that's a good problem. Um, but yeah, anyways, so you know, it's just important to remember, like, don't put too much stress on yourself. Don't be too hard on yourself. We're all going through our own journey. We're all going through struggles. And the point is that you keep doing it and one day you'll get there. Each day, you just keep trying to do the best you can in your meditation to give yourself that five minutes to just not think about anything, anything that's stressing you out, even if it's something good, because we know good stuff can stress us out too. Um, you know, sometimes you're so excited about a trip coming up or you're like really excited, nervous about a new job interview or something like that. And that's good stress. But, you know, it's just five minutes to just think about your breathing. Get yourself used to that because life stresses us out and you're going to be able to need to be on your toes to be able to catch yourself, bring yourself back down to earth and be able to breathe and focus and not just impulsively act. Um, so meditation is just a really good practice, I think, for that just to get us to spend five minutes not thinking about anything but our breathing or that mantra, that affirmation. And so I just really think it's good to do, even if you have OCD, if you have anxiety, any type of reason, even if you don't, you just find yourself a hard time focusing, just try it. You'll get better over time. It's just like anything else. The more that you do it, the more, the better you're going to get at it. Um, consistency is key in er anything in life, whether it's business, professional, um, your health. And so, you know, I could go on and on, <laughs> but you know, I just, I think this is going to be so fun. And, um, it's just so fun. It's like, so squishy and I'm just afraid I'm gonna get too excited I'm gonna rip it <laughs> but this is only like $23 so it's pretty reasonable but there was one on there for about 13 so I would say you don't even have to get this one I don't know what kind of material that was but I wish I had seen it because I probably would have got that one but I don't I don't think it was this material it could have been no I'm thinking of the hand weights yeah I don't remember seeing well I do remember seeing these so yeah <laughs> just ignore me. <laughs> um, they do have other ones. I just choose to go with her because she's been doing walking workouts for like 30 some years. And so she's got a lot of followers. And so I just figured, you know, help her out. She's helped me out realize that walking is fun. And it's, it's so much more to walking than just walking. You could do other fun things. So like, even if you're just going out walking down the street, you look a little crazy, but who cares? You're like doing something good for you. And, um, you know, if you find yourself on TikTok because you're out waving your arms all crazy because you was watching one of these walking workouts, then you're still doing something good for yourself. <laughs> Um, you know, you might get to the point you can start your own YouTube channel because you're just 
gotten the, the hang of fitness so good. Maybe you want to go to school for fitness. You could be certified. I don't know if on YouTube channel you actually have to be certified. I imagine you probably do because people are like kind of putting their joints and stuff in your hands. <laughs> um, but, you know, anyways. So, you know, I'm not a medical professional um, or anything like that. It's just my little two cents about things I like to purchase and why. Um, you know, you, you should put thought into everything you purchase just to make sure. Because how many times have we bought something and we think it's just so cool and it just sits and we end up like two months down the road just reselling it. Because you're like, I don't even remember why I bought this. But stuff like this is for your fitness, for your health, I think is just a, a wise buy. Because like I said, or anything that's just saving you time, something that's helping build you up mentally, physically, financially is worth the money. So if you have any questions, you can comment below. Any comments, you know, um, I'll let you guys know how I like this over time. It might be a little while because I have a lot of stuff I need to update you guys on, but <laughs> I will. Um, you know, because I like to recommend stuff that, you know, right now it's not really a recommendation. It's just kind of telling you what I've bought because how can I recommend something I haven't even used, you know? But as far as like usability, is that a word? This is like so fun. Like I would literally just hold this all day and just stretch it out and stuff like that. Anyways, I will see you guys next time. And if you like this video, hit the like button. If you would like to see more and you want to get future notifications, be sure to hit that subscribe button and the bell. Um, and I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching.